Hi friends, in this session we will discuss what is horizontal scaling and what is vertical scaling. Let's say you built a website and deployed over Google Cloud. You got a server with minimal hardware requirements and uh, deployed your website there. This is your server. You deployed your application here. Initially your website is not so popular. It used to get you around 100 users. You did a lot of uh, social networking. You brought awareness to your site. So what happened? More visitors started coming to your site and it became 1000. Once it reached 1000 users, it could not scale up. It could not serve traffic to 1000 users. To improve scaling, what you did, you have increased the capacity of the server. Capacity here is CPU, RAM, disk space. You increase the capacity and it started supporting 1000 users. Over the time, the popularity of your site has been more and users also increased more and more. It reached 1 lakh. Every time you face a scaling issue, you used to bump up your capacity that is more CPU, more RAM, more disk space and it used to support more users. This is called vertical scaling. Vertical scaling means upgrading server hardware. You will have one instance and you are, you are increasing the capacity of the server hardware. Over the time your site gained more popularity and more users but you have a limitation on hardware resources. You cannot cross, you cannot increase your hardware capacity beyond certain limit. So in this, in, in this case what happens your server will crash. There is another case uh, your server also can go down so your website cannot be accessible. So it's, it's, there is no redundancy. So what is the solution? The solution is horizontal scaling. In horizontal scaling we add more servers in parallel and deploy your application on each node. Let's say you have more servers running parallelly and independently. Each server is called a node. This is your application. Now you will have a load balancing. A user will reach a load balancer and through load balancer traffic comes to each node. Each node will have limited hardware capacity. Anytime your traffic increases, you are going to add more number of nodes. So this will take more traffic. Even when one server goes down and the scale will, the traffic will be distributed to other nodes. This is called horizontal scaling. So which scaling is good? Which one to choose? In my opinion, both are good. It all depends on your requirements. If, if you are in initial phases of your business, go to vertical scaling, you will spend less money. Once you established your business and it's doing good and you are attracting more traffic, then go for horizontal scaling. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel.